friends, welcome to my closet once again. You know what that means. That means I bought a bunch of clothes online again. Uh, I got a bunch this time. I got this big, big box delivered. Usually I just get like a big bag, but uh, this time it's a big old box. Oof. Make sure y'all can't see my address. Uh, but yeah, so big box of stuff that uh, we're going to try on today. Um, I think I want to maybe do my makeup first. I literally just got off work and just finished teaching a voice lesson. And then I was like, I want to try on all my clothes. Um, but like, maybe I'll do a little zhuzhing, a little zhuzh first. And then we will, uh, we'll see what we got today. I'm really excited about this order because I feel like I ordered some like just really great stuff. Uh, and once again, everything is from Shein. Um, don't at me about fast fashion until uh, there's reasonably priced, priced, reasonably priced plus size girl clothing that doesn't look like my grandma should be wearing it. Um, uh, that's my spiel. Okay, uh, back in a few. So, I, I still haven't done my makeup yet. Here's the thing. I just really want to open this. Uh, oh, hi, Frankie. Frankie's here. I don't think you can see her. Oh, maybe you just saw her butt. Anyway, so here's the thing. Uh, Dan can't get mad at me for this. Oh, hi, Steve. Uh, he can't get mad at me for this purchase because he, uh, for my birthday bought it. So... And I contributed um, $50. So I spent like 150 bucks. Um, but $50 of it was mine. And it was my birthday present. And like, a girl's gotta look cute. So, oh my gosh. There's so much stuff in here. <laughs> it's just big. Oh, I forgot I got fake nails. <gasps> Oh, I'm really excited to try these. Okay, I should put these somewhere where Frankie's not going to eat them. So big, 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 big. Ooh, more fake nails. Ooh. I have to do a close-up of these later because these look dope. Hey, guys, don't bite in here, please. Thank you. Excuse me. Big, big, big. most most excited about was uh this look so these are two separate pieces um I do think the corset part would fit better if I wasn't wearing the particular bra I am wearing however I think this still looks super cool so like corset at the back and I love this top oh my gosh okay. maybe do we need a little more light the only my only complaint is I wish I the top was a little bit longer, like without the corset, it's a bit like, it's a shorter top. Um, so I think a little bit longer would have looked a little bit cooler. However, like this looks, like this is a bomb outfit. Like you could, I could wear this to work. Like, I love this. And this, I'm not gonna lie, this material of this shirt is like <laughs> very, very nice. Um, but yeah, this is, I like this. So without the corset piece, Boom. So without the corset, there we have it. Super cute. Um, 
and I like the back there's like it's a like little zip up thing which is fun but yeah I love this looks good with jeans I think it would look cute tucked into like a a skirt or something da -da, da -da. anyways I'm glad I started with this because this was one I was most excited about I think I feel like I'm probably gonna end up saying that a bunch of times today but I do love this Okay, on to the next. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, sizes. I didn't do a good job of this last time, so I'm going to do a better job of it this time. So this shirt is a 1X. I sized down in all of my shirts this time around, uh, except for a few. I did get the corset. Uh, I got the corset in a 3XL because I wasn't too sure. Um, I'm glad I did, though. And, uh, okay, now on to the next. <laughs> okay so this next one was a very weird gamble for me I will say I think I really like it I don't think I'm wearing it right um but okay so this is a very cute very oh look at those cute little rolls oh my gosh how cute am I anyways um so this is like a really cute sweater type thing However, it is literally a scarf that you just stick your fingers, like your hands in. So I don't know if I'm wearing it exactly right. Uh, I think I'll need to find like a picture for reference. I also I think I need some more lighting in here. I'm going to go get another light. Um, but I do quite like this. I'll, um, I'll have to take it off and just show you what... It looks like just like hanging there because it's oh, ridiculous. Um, but this, I believe, oh, what size did I get? It's a good question, me. Does it say somewhere, somewhere close? So I got a, da, 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 da. Oh, I got a 1X. And I will say, I think the 1X was definitely the right size. I think anything bigger would have like just not fit like snug and held tight like it needs to. But this is, I do like this, it's quite cozy. I feel very Christmassy in it. Okay, uh, I'm gonna get another light and I'm gonna show you what this looks like not on me <laughs> so you can see how crazy it is. And uh, let's keep trying on clothes, shall we? Also, I'm starting a new thing. Everything I like, we're gonna hang up on this now empty rack. Ooh, a laundry basket, how fun. Okay, so that was a schmozzle. Uh, apparently my light thing is broken, so Dan is lending me one of his garage light ones. Oh, don't look right into it. Anyways, so this is, like, this is that top that I was just wearing. This is it. So it's a, literally a scarf <laughs> with, uh, with cuffs. But honestly, I'm loving it. That was so cozy, and I could just wear it as a scarf when needed. Oh, who am I? Jake Gyllenhaal? Bonus points if you get that reference. <laughs> okay, anyways, I'm going to let the dogs in and then let us continue our adventure. <laughs> okay, so I think I figured out the lighting. Hopefully. I mean, it's 4 o'clock and it's super dark here now. So, whew, I feel like that is dark. I've been, like, staring into uh, this one light for uh, a bunch of minutes trying to fix it. And now I can't see anything. Anyways, another top. Look at these little poofs. Look at them. Look at the little poofs. So this one is another work top. Very cute. Loving her. She's adorable. I would have maybe uh, sized up in this one. Like this. So this is a 1X. It fits fine. It is just very short. So like it's tucked in, but like barely, you know. Um, so I think a little bit longer would have been nice just because you could tuck it in uh, fully a little bit better. But I do love this color. Oh, my gosh. And honestly, these little sleeves, like, that kills it for me. I love it. Actually, this would probably look really good with that corset top, uh, too. So, anyways, top number three. She's cute. She's gorgeous. Again, this is a 1X. Uh, what do we think? Do we love it or do we love it? I know. We love it. It's fine. <laughs> Okay, hello. Ugh, can you guys tell it's cozy season because I'm buying a lot of sweater, a lot of sweaters? Um, okay, first off, a lot 
a big thing, if you guys want to know the drama of the plus size community, is that everyone's tired of cold shoulders. Not this girl. I love a cold shoulder. I think it just adds a little pizzazz. Um, they just have to be done like right, and again, not on clothing that looks like it should be worn by grandmama. Uh, anyways, loving this. It is indeed a turtleneck. Keep my vocal cords warm. Um, oops, I just knocked that bait down with my butt. Um, but the length is exactly right. I could tuck it in, make it look real cute if I wanted to. It is just cozy and lovely. So this is a 1X and it looks just great. I'm loving this. Also, we've changed the lighting again. It is very difficult to light my closet uh, in the winter I'm discovering. So bear with me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? But seriously, this looks great and I feel great. Yay! Okay, so I will say to begin with, I do not love this top. Uh, it just, I don't know, it's fine. Like it's good. I will wear it. I'll probably wear it to brunch or something with the girls. It's not bad. I just, I don't love it. Like I love the other items so far, but like it is cute. I don't know. What is it about this that I don't like? It does seem a little boxy. Maybe I don't like it with jeans. I don't know. Like this is, um, I was excited about this cutout, but maybe I don't like the cutout. I don't know what the deal is. I don't know what it is. I don't hate it. I don't love it. Um, that's my story. So let us continue, shall we? Uh, this one was a 1X. Yeah, it's meh. I'll keep it though. I still, I don't hate it. I just don't love it. Okay, so this next one was a very weird <laughs> choice on my part. I'm just, disclaimer, I love it. I am loving it. It's just, like, it is pointless. I will say that. It's very pointless, but I think it looks really cool. And I'm just happy that it exists in my closet now. So are you ready? <laughs> so I'm just going to start by telling you that I bought a, um, like a hoodie. Like a cute little crop hoodie. <laughs> that will not keep me warm. <laughs> but I love it so much. Okay. Okay. Are we ready? Should I just shimmy backward? Ta-da! Okay, so when you see this, you're like, oh, well, that's not bad. It's just like a cold shoulder, right? Like, cold shoulder, cute little crop. I actually, I love, I love this. I feel great in this. Uh, however, the back doesn't exist. <laughs> uh, so... That's why it's kind of useless, but it looks super cool. This would be great in the summer. I think it's going to be great for around the house. I think it'll be great to go out, like on the patio in the summer. I think this is a great look. I love this. Obviously a different, uh, I would not wear a bra with it. Um, but I do love this. I think this is great. Look at this. We can zipper it down if you get too, you know, if you get too warm, you can just zipper it down a little bit. <laughs> no, I love this. I think this is great. This one, she's a winner, baby. I mean, are you even a part of DD Speed Shop if you don't have plaid? And I honestly only have one plaid shirt, but now I have a few more. Uh, this I'm shocked at how thick it is. Like, I wasn't expecting the material to be this thick. It's very soft. It's very cozy. I did want it, like, a lot bigger just so I could layer under it if I needed to uh, for working outside. Um, but I like it. I probably could have gotten, I got, this one is a 3X. I probably could have gotten a 2X. However, I'm not mad at the 3X. I'm into it. It's, I don't know if you can see, it's pretty long. Uh, but tucked in is real cute. Tucked out is Lumberjack. Not mad at it. Not mad at all. 
So this plaid is not for working in the garage. This plaid is just because I liked it. I like this. It's got this big like built-in sort of twist at the front. I don't know if you can really see that it's twisting. But that's pretty much why I got this. And because it's like really big and can hang off the shoulder. So again, because I wanted a very loose look. With, like it's clearly too big. Uh, but I wanted a looser look with it. So this one again is another 3X. And again, shocked the material. Thicker than expected. Very cozy. Very soft. Very soft. Uh, yeah. She's cute. Okay, so this is the last of the single tops. Uh, then we're going to get into some cords. Uh, but this is bright. This is fun. Good for the beach. Definitely not for winter. Not why I bought it. But, uh, yeah, I like it. plain and simple uh but let's move on to some uh coordinated outfits shall we uh i know we said we were moving on but i was just taking this off and i actually kind of like wearing it like this i think that looks kind of neat uh it just puckers up here so you'd have to like i don't know tuck that in somehow but i actually i kind of like i think this is how i'd wear it i don't think i'd wear it the other way yeah yeah frankie would like my attention so uh a brief intermission, shall we? So I'm gonna have to re-rig again because I forgot that showing my whole body is uh, difficult uh, for these cords. However, I love this skirt top combo. Uh, so this is a 2X. I'm definitely glad I got a 2X just because it is rather form fitting, but oh, it's cozy. It's cozy and I love feeling like a little zebra. Woo! <laughs> uh, anyways, another quick intermission because I'm going to go to Canadian Tower with Dan. Ooh, should I wear one of my new things? I probably should. Yes. Okay, uh, be right back, friends. So, if you watched my last uh, fashion haul, you'll know that we are hopefully going to Hawaii. Um... Please let this happen. I want to go so bad. Anyway, so I am manifesting that it will come true and buying clothes already for Hawaii like this super cute shorts and top combo. How cute is this? I absolutely love this. Again, uh, we'll need to use the uh, booby tape to lift the girls. Um, however, like this is so cute. I am loving this and like so comfy. Um, I could have sized down, I think actually, so I got a 3X just because I didn't know um, how the top was gonna fit up top and how the shorts were gonna fit on the bottom. Um, so I could have sized down, I think I could have gotten a 2X, but overall, I'm still very happy uh, with my decision. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, I'm dead, I'm dying. Okay, last outfit. Okay, so last one. Again, I could have sized down. I uh, went with the 3X. I could have done a 2X. I probably could have even done a 1X, to be super honest. Uh, but still very cute. I do need to, like, fix the length of the top. There's just, like, a lot of gapping in the shoulders. Um, and, again, will require boob tape. Um, but I do want to show you guys a little jellyfish. Little jellyfish. So this one is very um, tropical vacation. I thought this would be nice for like a dinner on the beach, you know, it's a very long, very long skirt. Uh, like I said, the girls need a little boob tape help. Uh, but yeah, I love this. I think this is super cute. And I think we'll, I'll look very cute uh, walking on the beach and uh, sipping drinks and just being uh, cute, 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 cute. So there you have it. That is my fat girl fashion haul uh, for this time around and uh thanks for hanging out watching let me know what outfit you like the best and uh if you thought anything was like too weird <laughs> i'm very curious i honestly don't know what happened uh while i was clicking through because i feel like i definitely got some very out of the box uh items this time around but that's kind of part of the fun i think so yeah leave a comment and uh share this with friends who want some cute fashion uh fashion things for like 
you know, curvy girls with square bodies, right? Okay. <laughs> Bye. So I realized I forgot two things <laughs> after I did my little bye. <laughs> um, I, I realize many of you probably don't care about these, but I just want to show you the nails that I got. So this is the first one. Look, they've got these like little gray tips. I'm very excited. I've never used like press on nails before. So hopefully they turn out okay. Uh, I got these very colorful rainbow ones. Again, very exciting. The ones I'm most excited for are these ones, but they're very long, so I don't know how long I would keep them on for. But they're like little, little cheetahs. Isn't that adorable? I love them. Anyways, I just wanted to show you guys those. And the other thing I wanted to actually, not like be serious, but I mean be serious. Um, I'm trying to think of like how I even want to word this, so I don't know. We'll just talk and see what happens. <laughs> Um, but I've been getting like not a lot of comments, but some comments about people who don't love uh, that I use the term fat to describe myself. Um, and I just, I guess I just wanted to say that like, it's okay. Like I, I am aware of what I look like. I'm aware that I'm the word I would use is fat. <laughs> Curvy, plus size, whatever. I mean, all of those mean the same thing. Like, and that's not a bad thing. I'm not upset about it. I'm not mad at it. Um, so, like, it. I, I appreciate where you're coming from um, for the people that are upset when I call myself fat. Um, but, like, it's not a bad word. Like, it's just, it's not a bad word. It's just another word. It's like, I'm brown. I'm also brown. Not a bad word. You know, like, I'm a girl. Not a bad word. <laughs> like, it's just, it's another descriptor to me. So I'm not, see, Frankie agrees. <laughs> so when I call myself fat, I'm just describing, like, what I look like, and that's okay. Um, I also, like, I want to really get it out there that fat isn't, a bad word and like isn't an insult like I I don't know if you've ever read through my comments before probably not but like there's a few people on there that like really like to try to to lay it in and that's fine it's the internet um but like fat's not a bad word you know and just because I'm fat doesn't mean I don't think I'm like super beautiful and sexy and amazing uh as we all know I just tried on an entire closet for you I obviously think I'm the shit so <laughs> um I guess really what I'm trying to say is like love everything about who you are as a human. And I realize this is very like off brand uh, for me uh, or I guess for my videos, but you know, just as it comes up more and more that I, I guess like I'm going to keep doing fashion hauls because I just think they're fun. Um, and like, I love to show my body. We're all very, we're all pretty well aware of that if you've been to my Instagram. Uh, but because I'm not ashamed of my body and I love my body and it's a fat body, it has many roles. It has a belly, like that's okay. You know, like, it, like it's okay. It is what it is. So I'm 32, like it's, this hasn't just happened overnight. It's been a journey. <laughs> um, but anyways, so I just, I, I don't know why I felt like I should, well, I do know why I felt like I should address it just because I know some people like kind of got on Dan's case because they thought like he was calling me fat, which like, he's not wrong if he did. <laughs> um, but yeah, I guess I just kind of wanted to clear it up. I don't know if that cleared anything up, but as it stands, I do just want to say on my channel, fat is not a bad word. <laughs> See? They concur. There must be a delivery driver here or something. I don't know what's going on. But anyways, I'm going to leave it at that rambling end. And uh, basically just say, like, this is a safe space. My comments are a safe space. Um, and I just really hope that you love being in your body. And if you don't, and you need to talk to somebody about it, then you should talk to somebody about it. I mean, not me, I'm not a professional, but like, you know, you're pretty cool. So take care of yourself. Okay. 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 I'm going to go attempt to put on, oh, which of these nails do I want to put on? I don't know.
but it's gonna happen. Anyways, now for reals. Bye!